Hey everybody and welcome back. So this is just going to be a quick little speed through on how to get this green eyeshadow look. This is my first time really doing a full green eyeshadow look because I really don't like green eyeshadow that much but I really like how it came out so I just wanted to share it with you guys. So first I'm just taking my Cover FX Blurring Primer and I know I used a lot of it. I've kind of been using a lot of it lately because my face has been super textured and garbage and now I'm taking my Koki foundation and it shot everywhere and got all over my desk. And I'm just using this brush and blending it in. I usually use a beauty blender, but to be honest, I didn't feel like getting up and dampening one, so we're using a brush today. <laughs> and then I'm just taking my Revlon Color Stay Concealer. I don't like this concealer that much, but it gets the job done, and I have it, so I'm using it. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I'm doing. And then um, I'm just taking my CoverGirl Loose Setting Powder and setting my under eyes. I look weird <laughs> and then I'm just brushing up my brows getting ready to fill them in and using my favorite brow powder ever in the world from the brow gal I always use the darkest shade and I basically just outline the tip of my brows I don't really do much to the front of them because they are on the full side and then I'm taking my Kylie concealer which I always use as an eyeshadow base every single time and I'm taking my Maybelline pressed powder and setting that just because I do like setting my eyeshadow bases and I'm just going in with this little Ofra single shadow blush thing that I have and just kind of doing like a transition color and now I'm just taking that green shade and I'm just putting this in my crease and I did go over this a few times, like two or three, just to really build that color up because I really want that green to show through. And then I'm taking a darker green in my subculture palette and I'm just putting this all in my outer corners. And it does look a little patchy. It's because I don't like this brush. This is the brush from BoxyCharm, but <laughs> I like the shadow. And then um, I'm taking some concealer. I know I jumped into this kind of fast, but <laughs> I'm just kind of doing like this odd shaped cut crease. I don't know. This is the shape that my brain envisioned the look. So it's kind of like a weird zigzag kind of thing. And I'm actually going to set this with a light green color that I'm about to show in a second. Um, but I didn't record myself packing it on because I don't know why. I guess the camera wasn't going. So I don't know if you can see it's like a zigzag type shape thing and it's okay if it's not perfect because we're gonna blend in all those edges anyway and this is that green shade i was talking about it's a mac eyeshadow taking that olive green shade and i'm just gonna kind of blend those two colors together because you can see it looks a little crazy right now but that's okay because it'll all be blended in the end and i'm taking the actually the vibrant green shade and subculture and putting it in my inner corner i didn't feel myself doing that either i don't know what happened Taking the dark green, putting it on my lower lash line, pretty much what I did to the top. And then I'm taking the same green shade that I used in my crease and blending that on the bottom and smoking it out. And now I'm just taking yellow and I'm putting that in my inner corner on the bottom just to give it like a pop of color. And then I have a brand new Double Decker Butter London Mascara, my favorite. Love it. Opening a mascara for the first time is the best. And then I have a Milani matte lipstick on. I think it's called Matte Beauty, maybe. And then I'm just putting one of the Kylie glosses over it. I think this was the one in Damn Gina. And I always put them on and smear them out like this. Always. And this is the final look. This is just me with my flashlight trying to show the glitter. <laughs> because in real life, it really was glittery. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye.